All eyes were focused on the weather over the weekend. Blizzard conditions slammed the entire Lehigh Valley, which caused record-breaking snowfall. If you recall, last week meteorologists were predicting that we would only see 6 to 12 inches of snow with locally higher amounts. But that's obviously not the way this played out. This system took a little bit of a turn, causing us to see much higher snow totals and broke records, which I'll discuss later in this report. The storm moved its way into our area shortly before 9 or 9.30 in some locations, with only a few light flurries, but then Saturday, it was full speed ahead, leaving a big mess for everyone to clean up Sunday morning. Just take a look at this time-lapse video of all the snow piling up in Allentown, recorded by my friend Scott McKenna in his front yard. Now that's just a taste of what all of us saw around here. Plenty of church and worship services were canceled Sunday in addition to numerous businesses. Instead, people were working to dig out their cars, clean their driveways, and shoveling their sidewalks. Some even got stuck in the process like this Jeep in Williams Township. Many gas stations ran out of gas and had to turn people away due to the high demand with plenty of people hoping to fill up their gas cans so they could continue digging out by using their snow blowers. On Monday, Allentown Mayor Ed Pulowski said that they've hired private contractors to assist with their efforts to clean up, in addition to their public works crew. Just about every school in the Lehigh Valley was closed Monday and Tuesday thanks to the treacherous conditions. School district employees spent both days plowing, shoveling, and salting parking lots and sidewalks in an effort to get students back into the classroom on Wednesday. Now, like I mentioned, last week meteorologists were predicting 6 to 12 inches of snow, and most meteorologists completely dismissed the NAM model, which predicted the storm almost spot on. Here's what WFMZ-TV chief meteorologist Ed Hanna had to say about that. I kept saying, we're nervously dismissing the NAM. People are saying I'm going to give it more respect. My answer to that is... Most meteorologists just give it a glancing pass, but I can promise you, Mark and I said we will certainly uh, give, give an AM a, a glancing look and certainly some consideration. Now, with that said, this system was one for the record books. We saw 31.7 inches of snow over the course of only 24 hours. That total exceeded the previous snowiest day, which was February 11, 1983, with snow totals reaching 24 inches in 24 hours. Overall, this blizzard that we saw over the weekend was pretty incredible and definitely one that people will remember for many years to come. Reporting for the Warrior News, I'm Caleb Colley.